Watson. We all know this community lives for its Packers, and the green and gold came out of the tunnel a short time ago, and it was loud. We are ready for football. So are they as the Packers get set to match up with the New York Giants. And the opening kickoff will not be returned as that will be a touchback. Play fake to Jones. Here's Rodgers. And that is incomplete. Took a shot there on first down, but he couldn't reel it in. But they certainly came out firing in this one, and while that one was incomplete, I can't imagine that'll be the last shot that they take in this game. So the incompletion, and now it's second and 10, again from the 25-yard line. Now the man from UTEP, this is Aaron Jones. Four yards the gain, and it'll bring up a third down. That second down play call was not to pick up the first down. It was to accomplish what they did to get them into a manageable third down because they had the incompletion on first down, so they were behind the sticks, so to speak. They needed to make up some ground, and they did. This defense looking for an early stop. This is third down and six. To throw, it's Rodgers. And oh, that nearly an opening drive INT, but it does fall incomplete. Not the way he wanted to start this ball game as it brings up fourth down. So still a scoreless game in the first, but they're going to go for this thing on their own side of the field on fourth down. They'll go for it. It's Rodgers. And he fires one that's intercepted. Picked off by Logan Ryan. And he'll get this back to the 32-yard line. That right there is the inauspicious start that they were hoping to avoid the turnover on the first possession. I love how you use those college-bound words like that, inauspicious. Well done. I really appreciate that. Thank but you. here's the thing for me. I'm just wondering if their game plan is incorrect. You know, I think they felt like they could come in and throw it around pretty well. That interception early, they may rethink how they go about attacking. From the 32 now, here's first and 10. Throwing Jones. Flush to his right. He finds the speedster Ross. That's complete. And he will take it on in for a giant touchdown. John Ross, 32 yards. And the Giants have taken the early lead on the road here at Lambeau. Graham Gano on for the extra point. It's up, it's good, and the Giants have a 7-0 lead. Gano now following the touchdown here to kick it away. Rodgers going to return it from his end zone. And only able to get this to the 19, so probably should have opted for the touchback. The Packer offense ready to get their next drive underway. And following the interception, we'll see what they can put together on this drive. I can hear my old college coach right now. He always used to tell us before every game, the team making the fewest mistakes will win. 
What they're hoping is that that last mistake is their only one of the game. Coaches, that's all they talk about, turnovers, right? <laughs> Minimizing those and maximizing opportunities. And he's missed now in his first four passing attempts. The rhythm is just not there to begin this ball game. Here's second and ten. Rodgers with a give. It's Aaron Jones. And this Giants defense getting off the ball quickly. They stop him behind the line again. They lost four there, and it's third down. Now Rodgers. And that's going to be incomplete. The coverage, too good there. The contact popped the ball free, and it's fourth down. Two drives won't tell the story of this game, but you absolutely have to like how this defense has played thus far. They have yet to allow this offense to get untracked in this one. Now, remember, they were unsuccessful earlier in this first quarter. Going for it on fourth, they're going to try a second time. They do go for it. It's Rodgers. And he'll let this go deep for Lazard. He rifles one that's intercepted. Picked off by Keon Crossan. And the return here is stopped at the 35-yard line. What a start defensively. Your offense goes out. 